short dance. They are the, the former world champions. They are exquisite. The European champions. This is Gabriel Papadakis and Guillaume Cizeron of France. Well, Boston has seen some art in its time. That, I forgot it was a short dance. That was sensational. It is art on ice. From Gabriella Papadakis and Guillaume Cizeron of France. Just sensational. I just think it's, it's rude to talk over that quality of skating. I just, as a purist, their skating skills, his in particular, are just From off the France, scale, off the scale. Gabriella Papadakis and Guillaume and, and it was amazing that these guys, they're possibly the youngest dance team in the entire event. And earlier in the season, uh, she had a concussion and she was off the ice for a long time and a lot of people had speculated that they wouldn't be able to be competitive having had such a, a prolonged period off the ice. But to me, when you have such ingrained good quality, that will never leave them. This couple has skating skills that are almost unbeatable that won't ever leave them and, and I think a lot of people were incorrect in assuming that they might be off the mark this year I made a point of watching her oh really? because I watch him oh, yeah, I yeah. love his skating he, he's and I made a point of watching her and if you just watch her uh, for me she's just absolutely amazing oh, every good. eye line every neckline every extension every movement and it's the the complementariness of them together which is extraordinary well, yeah that's interesting and i think the person that needs praise here and a little shout out 
is her mother because Catherine Papadakis was their coach initially for many, many years uh, in, in the mountains in France. And I think that it's her work which is embedded in them that quality. There's no doubt that the French uh, have always produced good quality ice dancers and most notoriously Muriel Zazui and, and now mm -hmm. uh, Roman Ugenauer. But I think a big lot of respect has to be given up to, to Catherine Papadakis, who, who really is, has given them a quality that is, is making them the reigning world champions. And part of it is natural for him, isn't it? His, his natural flexibility, softness. But if you just look at, look at her all the time, everything. It is complete theatre, and we've seen great theatre tonight. It's been a, a superb event. But... Wow. Yeah. And I mean, for me, I, uh, <laughs> my pupils will laugh because I'm always referencing him because I, I do think his skating skills are so impeccable, but they're only world champions because they're both strong. Yes. And it's nice to hear you praising her so much, too. Well, what an evening we've had. The judges, you can go where you like now. You can put the tens out. You don't have to hold back. Shubatan is in the lead at the moment. The highest they've had is 71.94 for a short dance. Please do more than that. Oh, thank you. 76.29. The highest they've had by five, nearly five points. Has them in first place. So, so well deserved. We hope you enjoyed the short dance We competition. did enjoy the short dance competition. Thank you, announcer. Shibitan is in second place. Madison Chop, Evan Bates in third. Then the two lots of Canadians, Weaver and Poget, Pippa Gillis and Paul Poirier. We'll see the results at the moment, but they've got a standing ovation and fantastic result from the judges. And great to see the American crowd who so desperately wanted...